narrated by Ali bin Hussein. Safi Yabint, daughter of Huay came to the Prophet in the mosque, and when she returned home, the Prophet peace be upon him accompanied her. It happened that two men from the Angsar passed by them and the Prophet called them saying, She is Safi Ya, those two men said, Subhan Allah. The Prophet peace be upon him said, Satan circulates in the human body as blood does. Narrated by Abu Burda. The Prophet peace be upon him sent my father and Mu'adh bin Jabal to Yemen and said, to them, make things easy for the people and do not put hurdles in their way, and give them glad tiding, and don't let them have aversion, means to make people to hate good deeds, and you both should work in cooperation and mutual understanding. Abu Musa said to Allah's messenger peace be upon him, in our country a special alcoholic drink called Albit, is prepared for drinking. The Prophet peace be upon him said, every intoxicant is prohibited. Narrated by Abu Musa. The Prophet peace be upon him said, set free the captives and accept invitations. Narrated by Abu Humayd al-Sidi. The Prophet peace be upon him appointed a man from the tribe of Bani Asad, called Ibn al yudabiyya to collect the zakat. When he returned, with the money, he said to the Prophet, This is for you and this has been given to me as a gift. The Prophet peace be upon him stood up on the pulpit, Sufyan said he ascended the pulpit, and after glorifying and praising Allah, he said, what is wrong with the employee whom we send to collect zakat from the public that he returns to say, this is for you and that is for me. Why didn't he stay at his father's and mother's house to see whether he will be given gifts or not? By him in whose hand my life is, whoever takes anything illegally will bring it on the day of resurrection by carrying it over his neck, if it is a camel, it will be grunting, if it is a cow, it will be mooing, and if it is a sheep it will be bleeding. The Prophet peace be upon him then raised both his hands till we saw the whiteness of his armpits and he said, No doubt. Haven't I conveyed Allah's message? And he repeated it three times. Narrated by Ibn Umar. Salim, the freed salve of Abu Hud Haifa used to lead in prayer the early Muhajirin emigrants, and the companions of the Prophet peace be upon him in the Qubba Mosque. Among those, who used to pray behind him, were Abu Bakr, Umar, Abu Salama, and Amir bin Rabi'ah.